Hello friends. By using this machine, I am going to show you cardiac marker test, or you can say triple marker. By this kit, GP, you can see CKMB, cardiac troponin I, and myoglobin. It is also called triple marker. By using this machine, we can process this test. And which method is followed? It follows immunofluorescence. You can see here immunofluorescence assay. This is the display of the machine, and it is the printer, and connected electronically. Here is the back side. There is a switch. I am going to on the machine. As you can see, after on the machine, here is the preface. By pressing the plus button, you can set the details of the patient. Make sure that age. 68 and gender by this point you can change the gender male or female i am not going to give the barcode and in this method look at this here is sample mode sample mode either serum or plasma here is the sample mode here is the sample mode you can process serum or plasma or whole blood or urine or stool for each specific test in this case for cardiac marker test i am going to use serum that's why i am going to select serum or plasma this test mode is very important you have to select here it's showing outside mode but you have to select inside mode by pressing this just touch this this is a, and here is the kit by which i am going to perform the test look at this by this single kit you can easily assay ckmb troponin i and myoglobin and what is the method it follows immunofluorescence assay that means immunofluorescence method is used in this machine after given all the details in the machine you have to click this right icon the machine is ready now i am going to open the kit for further procedure you can easily see the kit here i am going to transfer 100 microliter of sample and after after charging the sample i am going to insert it to the machine this is the serum sample i am going to transfer 100 microliter of serum sample one see 100 microliter I am going to charge this place. Look at this. The sample is spreading. Now, I am going to insert it here. Kit loading site. And the arrow is this way. That's why I am going to insert it this way. Press. light a little bit and now you have to start the machine by touching this as you can see the kit is inserted in the machine automatically here it's showing 600 second is usually required for cardiac marker test Let me train minute. Look at this. I have given the details. By using this machine, we can perform all other tests just like interleukin six, procalcitonin, D-dimer, anti-pro BNP, or cardiac troponin I separately. 
etc. Wide range of test you can be performed by this machine. The test is still running and I am going to show you one special thing about this machine. Look at this. The SD portion is for chip calibration. For each and every test, you can see the kit. Inside the kit, there is a chip available. Before performing the test, for first time, we have to insert the SD card into the SD portion for calibration purpose. Please wait, I am going to show you the SD card for chip calibration. Just look at this. This is the chip. You can see CKMB, cardiac troponin I and myoglobin. This is the chip and we have to insert it. We have to insert it this way. This way. As the test is running, I am not going to insert it. As I insert it previously before running the test. This chip is not necessary to insert every time during the test. You have to insert the kit in this SD, SD card section while you are opening a new box for calibration purpose. Only one time is needed. And this box is usually contains 25 kits. It contains 25 kits. You can see 25 kits. For 25 kits, while I am opening the box for the first time, I have to perform the calibration by inserting this chip into the SD portion, SD card portion and the machine gets automatically calibrated. After that, you can perform the test. The market value of this machine, this POCT machine is less than 1 lakh. You can afford it. Look at this, the AcuDex and the model number is AcuDex CQ. Now, let's see. It's time to show you the result. So 100% completed and here is the result. You can see and you can see also the machine. Look at this. CKMB value 16.17 nanogram per ml and the reference range less than 5. You can see the cardiac troponin I 7.21 and reference range is less than 0.1 myoglobin is in normal range as you can see the reference range is less than 70 by seeing this result anyone can assume that the patient having cardiac issue it may be myocardial infarction or maybe heart attack or maybe cardiac arrest the kit is automatically getting out can see within 10 minutes I can get the result of three cardiac marker at a time CKMB cardiac troponin I and myoglobin here is the printing result I am going to detach it after performing the test you have to press the return button return and it is the preface we are going to off the machine there is no other button here is the only one button I am going to off the machine thank you for watching